Hi, I'm Becky, and as part of my research in mathematical biology, I look at cell migration into the extracellular matrix. The extracellular matrix is a very complex meshwork of proteins and other molecules that can make up to 70% of our tissues. I have this one model here that I'm simulating, where we model the cells as U and the extracellular matrix density as M. And when we simulate this numerically, we see waves of invasion that look like this. Our cells are modelled in blue and our matrix in red. I'm going to look at one particular case of this here, and that's where our extracellular matrix degradation rate, so the speed at which our cells can degrade the extracellular matrix as they move, is zero, so they don't do it at all. What we find is that the extracellular matrix stays constant everywhere, as you can see in our graph here. And when I simplify our equation, it looks very, very similar to the Fisher-KPP equation. This is a very well-studied equation in mathematical biology, and what we know is that the minimum travelling wave speed of these equations will always take the form of 2 times the square root of the parameters r and d. Thankfully, I can now apply this to my equation that I've already simplified to find that the speed of invasion of my cells here is always going to be at least 2 times 1 minus m bar, our initial matrix concentration.